try to map everything we can detect with a telescope that's moving in our solar system because if we watch it long enough we can determine its orbit fairly precisely. So NASA's been tracking a bunch of asteroids and one of them we knew was going to pass very close by the Earth, well relatively close by astronomically speaking to the Earth today. We've known about it for a while and indeed it did. It is not at all related to this meteor over Russia. They are completely separate independent events. These objects were in completely different kinds of orbits. The meteor that was seen over Russia today was approximately, the estimates are somewhere around two meters, which is about six and a half feet. Um, objects like that can be expected to impact probably more than once every hundred years. Finding something that small is extremely difficult, which is why we didn't see that one coming. So the good news is, the more damage they're liable to cause, it's because they're bigger. Bigger ones are easier to find. Bigger ones are also rarer. The smaller they are, the more of them there are. We get impacts every day, many of them, but they're tiny, nobody notices. Most of them burn up in the atmosphere. So sort of the, the significance in a way of this meteor is to kind of give everybody a little bit of a wake-up call that this stuff can happen. It, it, and it's even that thing's, you know, once every 50 to 100 years, let's remember that. And it's been a while since we had an event like that.